famed producer Roger Ofime is bringing the old Nollywood horror theme back in his new six-part Mystic River. The series, which will star known and relatively new faces, tells the story of the mysterious disappearance of pregnant women in a remote village. Details in this opening report. It's difficult to sacrifice one's life. Especially if you have attachments, I can to save it. Mystic River, a paranormal movie series produced by award-winning filmmakers Rogers Ofimi and Charles Obi Emeri, premieres in Lagos. We wanted to do something surreal. We, we, we wanted to do um, something uh, different from the norm. We wanted to do, like you rightly said, something that would take us back to the roots of where we started our storytelling before we now cascaded, so to say, into telling stories that are foreign and all that. We want to just go back to our roots. The six-part series tells the story of the mysterious disappearance of pregnant women in a remote village. I've got a very strong background making series um, from my days at from my days uh, at Tinsel. Um, <clears throat> so I'm actually the first producer on Tinsel, and that was there for several seasons before I handed over. So from Tinsel to Hotel Majestic to Hush, and these are big projects. These are big series. So I've got the I've got the flair for making series. Um, this one is also an exception. And um, when I got the story, I, I think it's better to tell the story um, in, a, in, a, in a serious form. So that way you've got, a lot, a lot, you've got enough time to unravel the story and then carry people along and then get to, get to a reasonable ending. The writer, Jeff, Jeffrey Musa, walked into my office and then showed me this beautiful um, teaser. And I'm like, I love this, I love this. I was actually captivated with the, the theme of the story. You know, and I'm like, you know what, let's make this. And that's actually how we started. So we had several workshops and then, boom. Set in Omu Forest Reserve in Ogun State, the flick has a mix of new and established cast. I never had uh, initial concerns about new faces. And those new faces, so to say, are not altogether new. They are, they are cutting their, their, their teeth, you know in their various you know, capacities and they are just trying to climb up the ladder. But the producer and I, what we had going for us was the belief. We had plenty of belief and we were audacious. And because we had that audacity of belief, we were able to surmount so many other things people would see as obstacles. We didn't see such. We saw talent. We saw acting. You know, we saw actors. We saw the ability to interpret the role. That was paramount for us, not the faces. The lead character, Lota Chuku, who portrayed Abere in the movie, talks about interpreting her character. I got the script very early, so that's always good. You know, you get time to... And it was a character that had um, different stages. So what you guys saw is like probably stage one of four or five. So, um, yeah, so that, that was... That was um, it was it was awesome because you know there was proper preparation. Uh, we got to camp early. We were able to you know get into character and everything. So 
it was it was great. It means a lot to me, and I I don't think there's any actor on this earth who wouldn't say the same thing. Cause first of all, it's a one in a million kind of project. It's something that you wouldn't see regularly. It's something I've never done before. It's something no Nigerian actor can probably say they've done before. I mean, we're in the forest for almost three months, right? So it's a project that we put our all into. There was zero network. There was um, literally, you know, no cars, nothing around at all. And, uh, you know, it was something we had to put our heart into. So we expect the best from it. And then this project is something I've been really looking forward to for a while. And uh, it's different. It's different. That's why I should say it's a very different kind of story. So I think it's something people should look forward to watching. The Uza Dima Okpechi directed series, which took about a year for post-production, stars Jide Kosoko, Dele Odule, Ben Tutu, Joke Muiwa, Telma Nwosu, amongst others.